Hello, Christian Viber. You're welcome to your favorite gospel time in Block House, Christian Vibes TV. If today is your first time watching, kindly click the subscribe button to receive daily notification and post alerts. The past few weeks have been very detrimental in the city of Ovalde in Texas, USA, after the unspeakable mass shooting took place in the Rob Elementary School. The children and teachers who were killed during the mass shooting have been honored in different ways and as Christians, we want to applaud one of these honorees. A family-run company by name Soulshine Industries in Edna, Texas, east of San Antonio, has donated 19 custom caskets for the victims of the mass shooting at Arab Elementary. The man, identified as Trey Ganem, spent time with the grieving families last week to learn about each child, so each casket is personalized, ranging from softball to TikTok and to Spider-Man. Marisol Gonzalez of Solar Designs and Justin Watts of the Graphics House helped with graphics and decals for each casket. Trey also designed Slain Ford Hood Soldier Vanessa Gullion's casket. In an interview with BuzzFeed News, Trey explained that the first obstacle was getting smaller caskets for children. These were made in Georgia where laborers worked 20 hours to get them built and ready to ship back to Texas. After the truck arrived in Texas, his son and the group of volunteers have worked on customizing the caskets of the victims. The work that is normally valued with a $3,400 US dollars to $3,800 US dollars was made for free for the families. He gave special care and representing. Trey gave special care and representation to the personality of each life lost. It is by this that we want to remind ourselves as people and as Christians that these times and seasons points to one and only one thing the second coming of Jesus. When we hear of such painful incidents, we remind ourselves the love, the care, and the impact Christ had on us, and we want to also share that same love and care and empathize with one another more than ever. If Christ had loved us unconditionally, we ought to express same towards our fellow human. May we all be steadfast as we are seriously Wait for the second coming of Jesus.
Let's go.